Fenville High School basketball standout Wes Leonard died in March after a stellar season. Tonight, his team's getting ready to start all over again. They're getting ready to play right now in 24 Hour News 8's Mark Thompson's live in Fenville tonight. Yeah, very emotional night, Brian. The game against Lawton gets underway at 7 o'clock. Now, Wes Leonard's family wants this to be an uplifting night, as well as the team and the community. Uh, there will not be a moment of silence before tonight's game, but the coach, Ryan Klingler, he will make a brief reading that is expected to contain a quote from Wes Leonard. Wes, as you remember, collapsed and died after making the game-winning shot last March. It was determined that he had an enlarged heart. Now, since that time, his parents, Gary and Jocelyn have been involved with the foundation, the West Leonard Heart Team. They've been pushing for legislation to require all schools to have life-saving defibrillators on site. Here at Finville, they now have a total of five defibrillators. Each school and district also has multiple ones as well. And Coach Klingler says that they now are looking for defibrillators each time they take the team on a road trip. When we go someplace, we're checking it out to make sure that uh, that place is a safe place for it. Not only for our kids go there, but uh, for other kids and other parents. Um, we want everyone to be safe when they enter a school. Now, Wes's younger brother, Mitchell, he's a freshman, but he is on the varsity team and is expected to play tonight. He won't start, but is expected to play. Now, we're told that Wes Leonard's father will not be attending tonight's game. He is simply too emotional still, but we're told that his mom will be in the stands tonight. We'll bring you complete coverage coming up tonight at 10 and 11 o'clock.